Hey guys, welcome to another Server Miner plugin tutorial. I'm your host, LTGM007, and today we're looking at the Battle Royale minigame. Now, Fortnite is very, very popular at the moment, and now you can have it on your server with this fantastic plugin. So, first of all, we're going to go through all of the commands, set it up, put down the sign, and then we are going to play a quick game with my other account. So, first of all, let's do forward slash Battle Royale and Battle Royale help will show us all of the commands. So first of all, we need to set a lobby and main lobby. So I've downloaded this bus from Fortnite and we're just gonna use this as our lobby. Um, so let's go here and do forward slash Battle Royale, uh, set main lobby. To start with, set main lobby. Once we've done this, we can create an arena. So we do a similar command, Battle Royale, create, and then the arena name is going to be server miner, like so. And once we've done that, we need to set a lobby point for that arena. So that's going to be Battle Royale, Set Lobby, and obviously the arena name, Server Miner, like so. Once we've done this, we need to add some spawns. Now these spawns need to be around the map, just randomly in the sky, so people can use the Elytra as a parachute to go down into the world and then start looting and killing people. So let's do 4 slash uh, BR, Add Spawn, and this is going to be for Server Miner. So we only really need two, but I'm going to set three or four, just to give you an idea. And you can make maps as big, as small as you want, um, like so. So there we go, we've set four or five spawns. Once we've done that, we need to set some chests so people can get weapons and whatnot to kill other people. So uh, just fall down into your world and do 4 slash BR add chest for arena server miner, like so, that. And we're going to just set quite a few just around so uh, we can loot and let's add one more up here there we go so once we've done that we are very close to being able to play so I'm going to teleport to my other account uh, I'll seven. there we go and we're going to pop down the sign so we can actually join so battle royale with capital letters at the start of the B and the R on the top line and your name of the arena on the second line now in the config you can set minimum and maximum players and waiting times but what we need to do is actually right click the sign and then we will get into the lobby. Now in here you can look at all of your achievements so I have won one game which gave me 10 coins and I got a first kill so that gave me 5 coins and obviously with these coins we can go into the shop and buy different trails which is fantastic. Then we have our stats here so we have a kill, a win and zero deaths. So I'm going to get my other account to join now and then the game will start. So as you can see my other account has joined and he has been teleported to the lobby. Then we have 15 seconds before the game starts. So here is the 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Here we go. So we spawn in the air and as you can see there is a trail behind me with the elytra. There's my other account. He seems to be going over there but let's not worry about him. All of the different spawn points for the chests have spawned the chest, and if we uh, crash into the ground, we can start playing. So all you need to do is just right click, and the chest will disappear, there'll be a nice particle effect, and we can quickly pick up the items. It's getting night time. Um, we can't actually use commands while we're playing, which is um, a good thing, but it is getting awfully dark. So let's go ahead and loot a few more of these, see if we can find anything good. We've got a, a diamond axe, which is pretty powerful, and a chicken egg that we could throw at him. Now I don't really know where he's gone, so we are going to, well we can't teleport to him, can we? <laughs> so let's run over here and hopefully we can find him. I might need to edit this if it takes me too long. So I have teleported to him using the console and once we're here we can obviously start attacking him. Um, so the only weapon we have is the axe, so let's give him a whack with this. Uh, on the right you can see a scoreboard and it says how many people are alive, how many kills you have. Then it comes up with top one, and congratulations, we have won the game with some nice fireworks and particles and whatnot. So that is how the game actually works. We are then teleported back to the lobby to have another go and see who can win next time. So I should point out this is a very new plugin, but I'm really shocked at how fantastic it works. It's really easy to set up, it works brilliantly, and it's just got some really neat features. So make sure you download this plugin below. Uh, there'll be a link in the description. If you need a server to host it on, obviously check out serverminer.com for the best and cheapest hosting around. And if you need to check me out, I'll be in the link as well. So subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.